21 win over Middle Tennessee State was the 19th straight in the Sun Belt for North Texas. Utah State would get their shot to end the streak the following week in Logan. This night would belong to freshman Jamario Thomas and to the North Texas defense that turned in perhaps the play of the year. Thomas ran through the Aggies like a breeze and set a new school single game record with 256 yards. Needed another third down play. Pitch out left to Jamario Thomas. Has a seat and a first down and four. 40, 30, 25, 20, 15, 10. Jamario takes it to the house. Expecting Jamario Thomas. And here he comes. Pitch out right. And he breaks a tackle to the 25, 20. Still pushing to the 10. Five touchdown, Jamario. How did he get on that? He has two touchdown runs already tonight. Off right guard. Bouncing off tackles and sprinting out left. He's got Scott Hall out in front of him. To the 30 yard. 25-20, back to the right, to the 10, down to the 5, still pushing his way. This freshman is spectacular. The Mean Green defense picked off four passes, and two defensive backs teamed up for a game-changing play. Lindsey backfield, here comes the blitz. They're chasing Cox, oh. and they sack the ball now. And it is recovered by North Texas' Sean Early. Empty backfield for Travis Cox. Back to throw, three steps out left side. Ball tipped up in the air and intercepted. Philip Gray called the deflection. Cox is back to throw, setting up, and he's looking deep. He's going to air it out deep, and the pass is intercepted by Marquis Milton. Cox back to throw. Has some protection, throwing over the middle, intercepted by Mendoza. Returning it to the right side. He's the midfield, and he banks his way down to the Utah State 44 yard line. Derek Mendoza with his first pick of the year, and that's what a mean green linebacker should do. First and 10, Utah State with their 20. Big rush up the middle. Tommy Harrison tipped it and intercepted, and he rumbles down to the Utah State six yard line. Fifth turnover of the game. Tommy Harrison. Utah State was driving late third quarter to take the lead, but the ball was jarred loose from QB Travis Cox by senior safety Markeith Knowlton. What happened next defied odds and logic. And Cox will try the quarterback draw again up the middle. He's to the five-yard line. Goal line fumbles. And North Texas recovers. TJ Covington's going to bring it out the end zone to the 10, to the 15, 20. Oh, my goodness. TJ Covington is going to take this 105 yards. He's to the 15. He's to the 10. He's slowing yeah. down. He's in the end zone. They ran a quarterback draw in the our two veterans, Jonas Buckles and Marquis Dalton, high load him at the goal line and force the ball out into the back of the end zone. Um, you don't ever get to hear what's on the headphones, but everybody's yelling, no, no, no. And then when he gets out to about the 20-yard line, everybody's screaming, go, go, go. But it was a big play. I don't know that one play could ever turn the season around or is the key, but that was a big play at that particular time uh, because it gave us some momentum to finish the game off. I think, I think it took a little wind out of our sails. And, and, um, but I truly believe um, in my players. If that play hadn't done it, we found another way to do it. It was the longest fumble return in school history, and T.J. Covington's play helped secure North Texas' first win ever at Romney Stadium.